Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today, I'm gonna be doing a current favorites video. I am so excited to show you guys my favorites because I love watching these videos on YouTube and I just never did a favorites at all. So I just wanted to do a current favorites because a lot of these things I have been using, some of them like over a year and some of them for a lot of months. So I just wanted to do a current favorites. Anyways, let's get right into the video. Please don't forget to give this video a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel and follow me on Instagram, Snapchat, Facebook, and Twitter. And so let's get right into the video. Okay, so really quickly, I just want to mention this shirt. Let me see if I can kind of show it to you guys. So it's just a graphic tee with this beautiful lady here with a sword and it just looks so badass. And I like how the sleeves are like white on this side. And when I posted a picture with this shirt on Instagram, this item actually became one of the more popular items on their website. So a lot of people actually like this shirt. So I just wanted to give it a mention in my favorites video. All of the information for this company will be in the description box below. So yeah, that's like my first favorite. Look how cute. So cute. Most of my favorite are going to be beauty related. But let's just get right into it because I think that this video is going to be long. So this first product is the It Cosmetics Bye Bye Under Eye Cream. I love using eye creams because I'm not super gentle with the skin around my eyes or my skin at all. I love using ice ice cream. <laughs> I love using eye cream to um, re-nourish the skin around my eyes. And this one by It Cosmetics is really, really, really good. It's supposed to smooth, brighten, and de-puff your eyes. But I really, really love the way this makes my skin like under my eyes and on. I put it on my eyelids as well. I really love the way that this makes my under eyes feel. It's really, really smooth and just like smooth. Shout outs to It Cosmetics. I really haven't, like It Cosmetics is just like my favorite brand so I'm just gonna mention them in general please ignore the sirens outside New York City right but I have not tried a product from it cosmetics that has just done me wrong everything from it cosmetics that I've gotten has just been so good like it's amazing it's amazing next favorite is my Clinique dramatically different moisturizing gel I've used this in like almost all of my videos this product I've had for like over a year like but this moisturizer it seriously works miracles like it moisturizes my face it just makes my skin look like juicy see <laughs> <laughs> it makes my skin look youthful. You can see I'm like here and I've been using this for over a year. So bomb. The next product I want to mention is a primer. This blur stick by Milk Makeup is amazing. It is silicone free. It does its job. It really does kind of blur your pores and it almost feels like it's there's nothing on your skin. Like this is magical. Like it really is magical. The technology is so good that I don't feel like it's going to break me out or anything. And it hasn't. So the next product that I'm gonna use is fairly new to me, but if you guys have been watching my videos, you know that Anastasia Zipra Pomade is like my holy grail for my eyebrows. But I went back to pencil, but I've been using the NYX Micro Brow Pencil, and this is in the shade Espresso. It's amazing, and NYX is super inexpensive. It is the only thing that I use to fill in my eyebrows. I'm not a huge fan of the spoolie, but I have like other spoolies that can um, easily replace this, but it's a good enough spoolie. Like I still use this when I'm filling in my eyebrows. NYX is super inexpensive and this pencil is super bomb. So if you're looking for an eyebrow pencil, I definitely recommend this one. Another favorite of mine is this Coconut Rose Toner Spray. This is fairly new to me. I think I got this about a month ago or maybe almost two months ago, but it's from the brand Kopari. I hope I'm pronouncing that right. All of my products will be listed in the description box below. It is sulfate free and paraben free and you can use this to refresh your face like your skin Skin, or you can use it to set your makeup or as a primer. I use it for all of those things. Um, this is amazing. Um, it has my skin glowing all day. If you want to try it, I definitely suggest this. If not, I'll definitely go for the Mario Badescu. I haven't repurchased my Mario Badescu spray in a while, but this one is definitely just as good. Okay, so now I'm going to move on to like highlighters and stuff. So I'm going to quickly mention the Artist Couture Diamond Glow Powders. This one is in the shade Gold Dig and it is the only highlight that I'm wearing now even on my brow bone and in my inner tear duct these um, diamond glow powders are amazing I really really like favorite shade is an Illuminati um, and I've been using these powders for like probably six months or so I cannot remember when I got them artist couture 
amazing. I also want to mention J Cat Beauty as one of my favorite affordable brands. They also make amazing highlighters. This one is in the shade Bella Rose. First of all, it's super pretty because it's an actual rose. This is the packaging. I'm not too crazy about the packaging, but I really, really love the print here. But these highlighters retail for about, I think, seven to nine dollars. Again, I will have that in the description box below. They perform at the ability of a high-end brand highlighter. I will swatch this for you guys. Can you see that? Like that was only one swipe. So, I mean, this is a little bit too light for me, but I do um, use this in conjunct conjunction with other highlighters and it is super pretty. They make really, really good products for really, really low price point, so. Okay, the next product is again from It Cosmetics and it is the Confidence in Your Glow Palette. I have three of these palettes. I think they only came out with three of these palettes. Um, I got this in a PR package and I have to say that this has become like my favorite bronzer, blush, and highlighter palette. Look at this, this is beautiful. The texture of these is super, super creamy. I love the packaging. This is magnetic here, so. And it has a mirror. I just have nothing bad to say about this. I really don't. The texture of it is super, super amazing. And I'm telling you guys, you have to give these a shot. I cannot say enough good things about this. I'm gonna talk about some eyeshadow palettes now. For those of you that have been watching my channel long enough, I think I've mentioned this baby so many times. I know I've mentioned it so many times on Instagram. The Too Faced Semi Sweet Chocolate Bar Palette is an all-time favorite of mine. I've had this for like two years now, I think. And a lot of them are like, well, this one hit pan because it's like one of my favorite shades. I think this is mousse, right? But this is such a great neutral kind of palette and it has highlighters. This used to be my favorite highlighter at one point. This black is so, so pigmented. It's my favorite black eyeshadow ever. Like, legit ever. So I just had to mention this and the fact that it smells like chocolate, I just cannot get enough Too Faced. I love Too Faced. I love Too Faced. I just want to mention some quick travel friendly palettes that I I always always go for these for some reason because they're just so quick they have the basic eyeshadows and they're amazing um this first one is this Inglot Freedom System palette is magnetic I mentioned this before it is one of my favorites these colors are just amazing I will swatch it for you hello pigment that is amazing but these are the colors could be more pigmented than that as you can see it's on my fingers super travel friendly and these are some really nice colors the next palette I'm gonna mention is also magnetic and it is the Rebecca Stella the squad palette I feel like it has the perfect neutrals. This black is also really really good. This matte cream shade is amazing It's super super pigmented. I love this transition shade So these sh four shades right here are the shades that I use the most This is perfect for like an everyday simple glam look or even if you want to take it to a night look I would just take this to travel and just this palette only like I can really just rely on just this palette palette that is a favorite of mine is my BH Cosmetics Carly Bible Deluxe palette. Um, I still have it in the case because I just got it so it's like my baby. You know when you buy something new you treat it like really really nicely. Like I even have the clear slip that comes inside the palette. <laughs> I treat my new things like super nicely and then after a couple months it's just regular this palette is so pretty carly bible is my top inspiration in the beauty industry um i just love her as a makeup artist as a beauty influencer and as a person overall and so this baby is so so pretty love this okay the next thing i'm going to mention is also from it cosmetics again 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 it cosmetics superhero mascara i want to know why nobody i have never heard about this ever like any video why aren't people talking about this this mascara is amazing i am not wearing any i'm gonna zoom you guys in i'm super up close and personal now but i am not wearing any lashes this is all mascara and look at this length and it also just spreads out my lashes so so freaking well my favorite mascara before this one was the Too Faced better than sex mascara but that one can get a little bit flaky sometimes but it's it's just at the top with this one but this is my ultimate favorite mascara give this a shot i'm telling you if you're looking for a great mascara give this a shot okay so i just wanted to quickly mention the covergirl outlast all day concealer Covergirl is super affordable and I got mine in the shade medium. This concealer, the applicator, I really love the sponge applicator. I know a lot of people aren't a fan of this, so the product just comes out of the sponge um, thing, but I love 
this applicator and I love this concealer. I will totally be repurchasing this for sure. The last makeup product is going to be these lipsticks by Renegade Cosmetics. Guys, these lipsticks are only five freaking dollars. Five freaking dollars, okay? And they are amazing. That, that, that is what makes it like amazing, is that it's only five dollars, but it performs amazingly. They were nice enough to send me their whole collection. I think there's 14 lipsticks in their collection. I'm gonna swatch these for you guys, but these are so creamy. Since I've gotten these lipsticks, I've literally been using them like every, like I cannot reach for anything else because they're so creamy. They feel so, so good on the lip. Um, Two of the shades that I really, really like, Bad to the Bone. This is like a really um pretty neutral. It's like kind of like a peachy. It's a nice, pretty, like neutral nude with a peachy undertone. Another one of my favorites, and I feel like it stands out the most, is Call Girl because it is really like pink with gold glitters and so, so cute. I think this was the first lipstick I also like wore from them, but it is really, it is right here. It's really reflective. I really, really like it. But oh, and they smell so good. Like they smell good, they perform good, they feel good, and they're only $5. You cannot go wrong with these. Okay, now that was my last beauty product. So the next two products I'm gonna talk about is hair products because I've been on my natural curly hair journey, so I have to mention some things for you guys. You guys know that Diva Curl has been my it brand for my hair since I started this journey. I want to mention Diva Curl as Diva Curl as a brand as one of my favorites, but I also want to mention this light defining gel from Diva Curl. This gel does not leave my hair crunchy. So I really, really just want to mention it because I feel like if you're gonna use a gel in your hair, please make sure that it's a healthy kind of gel. Another thing that I just discovered probably about a month ago or half a month ago is Aussie conditioner and it's a mega moist. Aussie mega moist conditioner. I've heard other curly, curly girls talk about this conditioner, but I was like, why? Like, why is it so good? It is good because it, it your curls just like defend fine beautifully with this. This really brought my curls to life. Last but not least, I have to mention press-ons, okay? I have press-ons right now. Press-ons are life for me. Whenever I do go to the salon and get like acrylic nails, it always costs me so much to go back and get them refilled. One, that's spending money every two weeks, which I'm not committing to that. And that's also just like, sometimes I just don't feel like going to sit down and it's fun once in a while, but for me, it takes up time and I just want to keep moving. So press-ons are life, okay? These are from Kiss. I do want to give a quick shout out to Witchy Glam. She sent me a couple of things. This is a mirror that she made for me. Look how cute with the Chanel symbol. The actual mirror has my name on it. She also sent me these brush holders, which is this one right here, this one right here. This lipstick holder is actually made from her too. So she does customize like brush holders, um, acrylic organizers and stuff like that. And she also has brush um, brushes that she makes. She has the mermaid tail and all of that good stuff. So definitely check them out. I will put the description, I will put the company in the description box below. That is finally it for this long favorites video. So I hope you guys like that. Please let me know if you like these kinds of videos where I talk about my favorite products because I like to watch these so I hope you do too and let me know in the comments down below what videos do you want to see next what are you feeling what are you not feeling I'll see you in my next video don't forget to give this video a thumbs up subscribe to my channel and follow me on Instagram Facebook Snapchat and Twitter and I will see you in my next video mm -mm. okay <laughs> bye